I beg your pardon? <laughs> I'm not a raptor, darling, not at all. No, I'm a harpy. A pig? What? Raptor pigeon? No, not a vulture. I'm a harpy. Half woman? Half, half, well, I guess raptor of sorts. But still, bird, half bird, half woman. I'm a harpy. And you look like you could use doctor. Well, yes, like people, veterinarians, doctors, same thing. Okay, well, we don't have to get picky on the word choices we use. Looky here, it looks like you are in desperate need of some medical attention. You will be bleeding out at any point. What the heck were you doing tangling with that there minotaur? Did you not see the bull's his horns? He's a bull, he has horns. Did you not see that? Interesting. Okay, so I'm just going to come over here and uh, here's a baby sapling. Let's pull some of this here bark off. Oh, great. Uh-huh. And uh, let me see that leg there. Um, Let me see your leg. Do you not want? You don't. Okay, that's fine. Here you go. I pulled that off for you. Well, I pulled it with my teeth. Yes, I don't have hands. Now, you're going to want to tie that around your leg. That bark's nice and young, thin and supple. It's got excellent, excellent uh, tieability. Listen here, I didn't say I was a sailor and knew everything about knots and all kinds of things. What I can say is that I absolutely know that that supple bark is going to make sure that you stay together. Oh, and it looks like you got um, wood of an entirely different nature in your... Pardon? Sorry, sorry. Back to back to the the task at hand, though. All right, so that's gonna help slow the bleeding down, but you're gonna still need some help, and you're gonna need to get out of here quickly before it. Big old Mister Stompy Foot over there decides so, so to come over here. Hmm. Big old Mister Stompy Foot. You're not familiar. Jeez. Pardon? Texas. I'm from Texas, like Lolly Chusa. Well, I know, but I don't speak Spanish the best, so it's La Lechusa today. Um, let's see here. Let's get you, let's get, if you can make it onto my back, you see those cliffs up there, they're going to be fairly safe, and um, there's going to be nobody who's going to hurt you up there, and I can better assess the situation and figure out what we're going to need. Well... The other alternative is for you to stay down here and be minotaur food. But really, I don't think he's going to eat you so much as just play with your body. And honestly, if someone's going to play with your body, it should be me. And we could just go right up there. You are absolutely infuriating today. Come on. Let's just, let's just go. Put your arms around my back. They're not broken or hurt, are they? Yeah, it's just your leg. Okay, here, look. Take my wing. Get yourself up. Oh, you're pretty light. Wrap your arms around my neck and just don't choke me. Tell you, Kylie, get your... Yeah, thank you. I might be a harpy, but I am also very susceptible to choking, just like everybody else. Huge gag reflex, and, um, well, quite frankly, I don't mind showing you how else I like to choke, but let's, um, let's get up there. Let's... Mm okay there yeah no you're gonna have to hold on tight i understand you can't really wrap your legs but if i lay flat like this and you on my back this is a well this is entirely an interesting position just want to point that out there oh don't mind don't mind having you back there no <laughs> all right if we just fly like this you won't have to struggle to hold on too much and it's a little bit not comfortable for me, but I'd imagine having your my leg ripped open would be a lot more uncomfortable. Nope, don't worry. Nope, that's fine too. You're bleeding all over the upholstery. It just means that we're gonna I'm gonna need a shower. And it's okay. I'm sure you wouldn't mind bathing me after I nurse you back up to health. Anyway, so let's continue. Okay. Mm. All right. All right. Set yourself down right there. Um I have some nice leaves over there. I like to make a nice, suitable place for you to sit down. No? You don't want to, no nesting? Hey, suit yourself. All right. Yeah, this is, um, I think I may have something for this. 
some fairies gave me nice pixie dust a while back that could be used for medicinal purposes. I might be able to close up that wound. It's still going to be, you're going to have to be off of it for a couple of days, but it'll at least disinfect it and make sure that it, it begins the closing process. Hmm? Well, the other alternative is to leave you up here, let you die, then throw your body off of the cliff when we're done. No, I thought that would be a shame too. The only rocks that I would want to be hitting will be right inside of your pants. So, yep. Okay, pardon? Why, yes, I have been saying many dirty things. Uh, I mean, you're a human, but I could, uh, I could, I could roll that way. I could swing in that direction. <laughs> well, let's get you patched up first. Here we go. Here's some of this pixie dust. Now, what I'm going to need you to do is hold your leg real still. This is still going to sting. It's not going to feel the best. Let's get a nice sprinkling in. Hey, don't move around so much. Just stay there. Well, there you go. There you go. That does it. Perfect. Yes, I know it stings. I, we didn't say magic was just, um, you know, magic. It's, well, it is what it is. It's going to sting a little bit. It heals you and you just need to breathe. Don't be, oh, geez. okay. Yeah. Okay. You're complaining a lot. Okay. Hold on. Um, painkillers. No, we don't have, what is Advil? No, I don't have leave. What, what do you, th what is it that you think we are? Are we humans? No, here we go. No, this is, this is a little bit of just some natural herbs that are going to naturally make your brain think that it is perfectly fine throughout this process. Hmm? Why, yes, the devil's lettuce is exactly what many people call it. Yes, your people do use it, which is why I'm giving you the stuff that you guys use. Where do you think you got it from? Where do you think harpies? It's a symbiotic relationship. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. You should begin to feel a little bit more relaxed soon. Keep your wound together, and I can go out and get you some food, and we'll get you cleaned up, and we'll get you on your way. So tell me, what brought you all the way out here? Okay. Hmm. Oh, well, I mean, to each their own. That's a... Uh, Sounds like a pretty solitary life. Where's your friends and family? Well, I mean, I think that's quite personal. No, I live by myself, and now I answered you answer. Okay, well, where are they, and why aren't they here? Hmm. You really are a unique group per sort, aren't you? Jeez, you get me so flustered, I can't even think straight. Can't even talk straight. Anyways, let's not focus on that. What we need to focus on is making sure you get better. So, all right, I've got, um, well, I've got what you guys might call a hamburger in here. Just uh, don't ask what the meat is. Totally not mice. Pardon? Yes. No, just go ahead and take a bite. Eat it. Mm, 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 mm. See? It's pretty good delicious no no really well i'm sorry i don't have the most amount of people food around here and when i go into villages they tend to bring out the pitchforks why thank you no most humans don't actually think that i'm all that interesting looking but it's very nice that you think that so let's get back to you let's let's get back so do you have a significant other at all no not at all? Hmm. I don't know. Just you seem like quite the catch here. Pretty silent. Allow me to babble and talk all the time. Very intelligent. Quick as a whip. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's something for us to discuss when you are finally on the mend. <laughs> all right. All right. No, that's... It's not common for harpies and humans to get together in any kind of way that, you know, doesn't involve us carrying you off to your doom. Well, I mean, someone might call this place doom. In fact, quite a few people have called it doom. But anyways. No? 
Well, it has been an absolute pleasure to meet you, but I think you're going to need your rest. And, well, we're going to check back in the morning to see if uh, a different sort of TLC is going to be needed. Hmm? Well, I was thinking pretty long, and I actually don't have an idea of what the C could stand for. Other than maybe you could come see my next Tuesday. <laughs> Hey guys, Zena Alexander here. Um, I've messed up stories. Thank you guys so much for um, signing up for our D&D um, session. We will have an official date coming out in about 72 hours, I'm hoping. And I'm thinking we might actually do multiple sessions. So, so many, since so many people signed up to want to do it, uh, we will be picking randomly. Of course, only those that can make the time and dates picked will be considered but we're going to get all that information out to you guys. If you are interested, the information is in our Discord, which is in the link in the description. It's also up at the top of this YouTube channel if you want to join. Um, I also would like to give a very special shout out to Swag and Annie, uh, who was in our live chat last night on uh, Discord. We play games at night and... Uh, a lot of times sit around and talk to each other. Swag is going to be coming out with a YouTube channel I'm super excited about. Annie has one, which will also be linked in the description. And I also would like to give a shout out to another community member for being absolutely amazing. And that will be Schooner Tuna. I absolutely love all of the artwork that you send me. You're so supportive of me. And I can't say enough how much it's, it's cool just to be able to know you. Um, some other things coming up. We are actually about the midway point through our 100 videos in 100 days challenge. We've missed like only three days, um, which had to coincide with my friend getting uh, being in the hospital and then some natural disasters. So I'm actually feeling really good. This is really cool. Everyone keeps asking me, what are you going to do after the 100 days? And I might actually continue it. I really do love this daily schedule. Um, I love coming up with these new ideas. And it's really no skin off my back. Some people think it's a lot of work. I find it to be not a, a ton of work. So um, if you guys are liking a vid the video a day uh, format, please give a comment below. Um, other things that we are working on. I, I know I keep talking about Patreon. I swear to goodness. Not another week is going to go by. Within seven days, it will be out or I give up. <laughs> I give up. I will go through and scrub out all mentions of Patreon from all audios, everything. Um, if it is not up, I'm giving myself that timeline. Um, even if I maybe roll it out. Uh, I don't know. I, I, there's there's a couple of different ways I can roll it out to where it will make sense. So I love you guys who have been super supportive and asking about it and being oh so kind in doing so. Um, commissions are still open. There's a lot of you guys that have been asking about them. Feel free to contact me on Discord if you would like for me to do a personalized audio for you guys. Uh, very few limits um, I have outside of, you know, what the typical that most people have. Um, feel free to ask. Don't be shy. Lord knows I am not. Um, plan to do a 6,000 live stream, which it, we are, we just hit 5,000 and we're not 5,300. So don't know what it's going to be. It just depends when we get closer. Um, thank you guys for all of your likes, comments, and, um, upvotes. It's, well, I guess those are likes, uh, likes, comments, and sharing this content. A lot of you guys have been going on Reddit and sharing it, which is really great. And bizarre in the best of ways but i love it anyways i love you guys so much and i will see you in the next ones bye